detailed and close reading of all the data in this NASA JPL video called Approaching Titan a Billion Times Closer, we can discover structures, anomalies, and much more. The video was published on January 14, 2015. The video zooms in into images of Titan from Cassini's cameras and a view from Huygens during the descent and landing. The areas you're watching now will be analyzed in more detail in this Alien Grey video. All these areas show anomalies and at 10 meters from the surface we see beings very similar to the biobots we see on Mars. The area at the top shows what looks like triangular platforms with ball-shaped domes and possibly smaller structures or buildings. To the right, we see more platforms with domes, and also, we see what seems to be curved tubes or pipes, or perhaps roads or tunnels. This bridge connects one part of the terrain with the part in the middle where we find much more structures. In the middle we find rectangular structures like a huge house, a large building. We find more domes in the bottom and the bottom left. We find many more examples of pipes or tubes, might be roads or tunnels. shows large structures that look like huge skyscrapers. We find a bridge in the middle and more examples of piping or tubes. This huge scarecrow-like structure casts a shadow, and it looks like a huge tower. Perhaps this anomaly serves as some kind of transmitter, or as some kind of sign for air transportation, or ships flying objects. And here we see more structures, perhaps buildings, and this anomaly at the top right could be a spaceship. Also in the middle we see what looks like a tower or pipe from a factory or plant with smoke or steam coming out of it. This could be a huge network of pipes, roads, or channels. Of course, it could be all natural. The top left, there's a small island with 
apparently another dome. This terrain shows this object that casts a shadow. It could be a cloud, but it could also be a ship or a floating dome. This whole area has many channels or huge pipes with openings or entrances or outlets at the bottom. It could be artificial. It's multi-layer that forms large buildings and domes. When the camera gets closer to the surface of Titan, here at 500 meters above it, we see this Manhattan-like area with what appears to be buildings, towers, and many structures. And this area on the left seems to be dug out from the surface symmetrically. And it has many structures embedded in it. And here, we see symmetrical pipes coming out of a large structure. And we see an arch over many other structures and which could be buildings or piping. And here we see an anomaly that looks like a four-legged animal, perhaps a reptilian or a dragon, looking at the Harbin's Pro. shaped structures and buildings. We see buildings with straight walls and box-shaped objects. distance of 10 meters from the surface, we are shown images that have severe blurry. Is something hidden underneath? The part we can't see is interesting. It shows box-shaped rectangular objects and structures, more platforms and more domes.
in the lower right corner, we can distinguish beings that look like the biobots we see so much on Mars. These beings also seem to be observing the Highlands probe. Titan seems to be a very interesting place, and in my view, these are not shapes and objects, anomalies and structures that are created by nature, but designed by intelligent beings. It looks like Titan is or was already visited by someone, sometime. Why is NASA showing us this evidence of extraterrestrial, organized and intelligent life? This is a form of control, leaked disclosure. Do we need to get adjusted to the idea? For us, the ethical moral question to ask would be why man feels so superior to all other beings? And how will we relate to life on other planets? What will we bring? Our fear or our love?